It's Saturday night. It's hockey night here in Nottingham. It's time for game three in our international four-pack challenge sponsored by Internet Motor Parts. Our opposition tonight hail from the West Norwegian town of Stavanger, situated just a stone's throw across the North Sea. The Oilers bring a great pedigree to the National Ice Centre, having lifted 11 championship trophies in the last eight years. This team are fast, they skate well, and they look effortless out on the ice. Nottingham Panthers come into this test with confidence, currently unbeaten in four pre-season games. The Oilers are expected to present a whole new set of challenges to a Nottingham Panthers side who are still settling into their systems and lines. John Rowe and Tyler Biggs return to the lineup tonight and head coach Rich Chernomaz is spoilt for choice with all players available. The Highlight Show is brought to you in association with the legend, Nottingham's number one family-friendly hockey pub. Let's go and see the action. Nice work there by Lakovic. He stripped his guy. Great takeaway there. But now we come the other way, two on two. The puck was coughed up. Nice move there, cutting to the inside. Shot, nice save by Garnett. He takes that one with a glove. And another big save by Panthers Netmine and Mike Garnett. Keep this one tied at zero. And again, the Oilers, if they don't have a good shot on net, they just put it deep and then try and get their cycle game going. Point shot coming in, nice block there by Farmer. And he springs Biggs. Biggs could get a step here. Good cover there from the defenseman. And Stevie Lee will bring the puck back as we come up to the halfway point in this first period. So far, better chances to the Oilers with a couple of power plays. Mike Garnett making some big saves. Oh, we'll turn over there on the blue line there. The Oilers can come this way. Oh, great play there by Risley. Polini's in alone. Polini shoots, scores. Brett Polini scores. He opens the scoring for the Panthers. 1-0, 9-49 remaining in the first. All came from Jane and Risling's defense splitting pass. And he puts Polini in one on one and he makes no mistake going five hole. One nothing Panthers. Now Polini, he has it. He twists and turns down low. Nice play by him back to the point. Rizzling over to Billingsley. Billingsley going to fire this at net. Through traffic there and a nice save. Good shot there by Billingsley through traffic, but the uh, Oilers net miner holds on to that one. With just under seven minutes remaining in the first. <laughs> Now Olsen, big Dylan Olsen back on the point then down to Piva. Guptill down on the goal line. Piva will probably be the creator on this unit. Back goal to Herchabees. Herchabees rips one and scores. Mark Herchabees rips one. Low blocker. And the Panthers lead 2-0. Great rip from Mark Herchabees. Great dish from Dylan Olsen. And the Panthers score a power play goal and lead by two goals to none. Oh, mini breakaway coming in here. He's got the step on Hughes. He shoots. Big save by Garnett, but the rebound's in. Great first save by Mike Garnett. Puck jumped up, and I think it just hit the forward. The uh, He was skating onto the play. Right off the shin pad and in. Great first save there. Off the shin pad and in. Bad luck there for Michael Garnett. He makes the first save. Nice play there by Luke Pither. He's got John Rowe going there in front, shoots and scores. Great move there by Luke Pither. He strips the defenseman and he hits John Rowe in front, who redirects that to the blocker side of the Oilers netminder. And with 17 23 remaining in the second, the Panthers now lead by three goals to one. Now back to the point 21. He rips one in. Nice save by Garnett there through traffic. He steers that rebound to the corner. Now the Oilers win possession down low. Across the blue on here, shot coming in. Nice block there by Kovacs. And a breakaway now for Guptill. Alice Guptill's in one on one. Guptill to the backhand. He shoots and scores. Backhand five hole. Panthers lead, four goals to one. Great dish up the middle to Guptill. He takes it to his backhand and makes no mistake. Panthers lead, four goals to one. Nice play there by Rizzing. Rizzing and Hughes, big and physical. And then Henderson comes out of the puck to Betridge. Nice play by Betridge. And now Biggs can get on it. Panthers are going to have a power play. 
Biggs didn't like that. Biggs drops the gloves. I don't think the uh, Oilers player wants any part of this. So we'll skate four on four. Pither and John Rowe out there for the Panthers up front. With Hughes and Rizling on the, on the back end. Oh, turn over there in front. John Rowe walks around the goalie, shoots and scores. John Rowe has his second of the night. And right off the face off, a bad bounce for the Oilers defenseman. It falls right to John Rowe. And great composure by him. He walks around the net minor and fires into the empty net. And after missing back to back games through injury, John Rowe comes back with a bang. He gives the Panthers a 5 1 lead. Oh, turn over there behind the net after the no icing call. Oilers get possession of the zone. They fire one in. Nice save there by Garnett, and he holds that rebound. No icing call there, and that kind of fooled the Panthers D. Now a bit of pushing and shoving in front of the net. And with 7.38 remaining in this second period, Panthers lead by five goals to one. Betrish as well to get in the lane there. Now the Oilers on, they throw one in Mike Garnett with a save and again great rebound control from Garnett, he holds on to that one. And with 39.2 seconds left, we're 5-1. Nice play by Doty, just high flips out the zone. Farmer's going to win the foot race, he negates Ison. Now the Oilers come down two on two. Farmer and Hazeldine back on D. Now the Waterman, late guy, coming in the slot, shot, a nice save, rebounds there, empty net. And that's a goal for the Stavanger Oilers. With a little bit of pushing and shoving afterwards. First shot there, block from the slot, rebound fell right to the guy's stick, half an empty net. And he fires into the empty net with exactly 12 minutes remaining in the third to make this one five goals to two. Oh, he walks in, shot, and that's in. Stevie Lee gets a piece of it. Stevie goes down to try and block it. It ricochets off him and high glove against Mike Garnett. Bad break there for Stevie Lee. Did everything right, but just takes a ricochet. And now with 10.04 remaining, we have a game. 5-3 to the Panthers. So two quick fire goals that lasted on the power play. Sees the Oilers get back into this one. Joining us is Panthers defenseman Dylan Olsen. Dylan, uh, another win for the Panthers, and we're on a little bit of a roll at the moment in preseason. Yeah, you know, it's awesome. Um, you know, the team, the more we practice, the more we play, the more the boys are going to buy into the systems and, uh, you know, figure out what we need to do to get into regular season here. And, uh, you know, it's been going well so far. Um, you know, as you can see from from the games that we played, that everyone's starting to buy in and uh, doing their jobs. And, um, you know, we're having success. And obviously having John Rowe back in the lineup, two goals for him and Tyler Biggs made a big difference having those two big bodies back. Oh, absolutely. You know, um, those are those are going to be key guys uh, down the road here. You know, uh, Rosie's, uh, you know, a skill forward and he's going to put up points like he did tonight. And then obviously having Big Z out there, um, you know, throwing the body around and getting the guys' faces. And, um, you know, that's, uh, that's huge for our team. And even though we've only played, you know, a handful of games, what do you make of the style of hockey in this league and, and the standard, obviously not playing here before? Uh, it's good. You know, obviously it took some uh, getting used to the first few games, just, uh, uh, you know, with the different size of the ice and everything. But uh, as we go along here, um, you know, they're fast-paced games, they're, they're high intensity, and, you know, it's they've been a lot of fun to play in. And then one more game tomorrow, four o'clock, so time to get some rest, but hopefully we can get another win there and then look forward to Sheffield next Saturday. Oh, absolutely. You know, uh, the boys are going to get some rest tonight and come back prepared tomorrow, and we're going to do what we can to close out the uh, preseason with another win. All right, Dylan, thanks for joining us, and good luck tomorrow. Thanks.